Uh, welcome back to uh, Gentoo's R Stentry uh, Timer Started. I'm going to take one more stab at this and one more way of doing this. Instead of using the casing that I think Gentoo did, I'm going to do a 3D uh, molding. And I think uh, this is probably what uh, David Michael probably would do. And he just, you know, a line right here. And I, 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 I'm assuming it's going to go up, up, up against that wall. So I'm going to con uh, convert it into a uh, convert it into a 3D molding. And I'm going to add a molding to it, delete that one, add a new one, go to user catalog, uh, my moldings, molding number one, OK. And this is going to be height, it's going to be 4, and the width is going to be 12. Add new one, molding number two, OK. Height is going to be 8, I guess. Width is 12. It's not inside. The horizontal offset is 12. Go back to this one. It's not inside. OK. I don't see it. I don't know where it is. That's why I hate these things. I can never figure them, figure them out. I mean, where where is it? I I don't know where it is, man. I, I just I could never find these mother. It's got to be right in there somewhere, doesn't it? D don't I? Oh, where'd it go? Moldings. MO molding it's turned on. Okay. Suppose I put it right here. Turn into a molding. 3D molding. It's not on the inside, it's on there it is. That I don't know what I don't know what happened to my other one. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to put put one right here. Shift P. Right there. Turn into a 3D molding. Okay. I don't see it again. Do you guys see it? Oh, there it is right there. Yeah, oh, here it is right here. Tab. Tab, tab. There it is. Nine. I mean, I, I don't like these 3D moldings. I can never, I can never control them. And, and now look what, the, you know, I don't get it, man. Oh, I know. Uh, <sighs> All right, here. Let me see if I can do do this. Turn into a three D molding. Uh, height is twelve. Width is four. You, and it's on the outside. Oh no! Oh, you! Uh, I had it wrong. It's on the inside. Yeah, I never, I never know how to do these things. And I think it's right there. Tab, tab. There it is. Move it. Can I? I can't move it. <laughs> and now I know it's all tweaked up. I just know it is. Oh. Now I guess I got it like this. Uh, you, no molding on selected edge. No molding on... <laughs> okay. You get what I'm saying? You, you can't mess around with these things, man. They're just, they're just too, too hard to control. Oh, there's the, there's the other one. I guess. I can't move it. I, I, what do you do with these things? I don't. I don't get it. I really just don't. You molding. It's not on the inside. It's not on the inside. Now it's there somewhere. Oh, and I made it. I made it too thick. You. The width is f two. 
and 12. And this is 4 and 8. Uh, horizontal offset is 8. There, now I'm getting it. Now I'm getting it. Oh, that's a lot of work. So now I just select this molding, pull it down, tab, tab, uh, cancel. Do it this way, F, to fillet it. Oh, I can't, I can't fillet it? I can't fillet it? So I'll pull it down, tab, tab, minus 18, I think. And I take this and I change it to an arc like that. So I got this all backwards. U molding one is two and it's eight. Molding two is four and eight. Oh, the vertical offset needs to be, I don't know, four? I don't know. U, vertical offset. It's four. Yeah, molding number one is, oh, two. So the, the vertical offset has to be two. I guess that's right, huh? Uh, I mean, it's... Uh, molding number two. Oh, I don't want the horizontal offset to be at all. Nothing there. Now I got it. So now, I, now you can see what I'm doing with it. And now I just select this material right here and see what that looks like. One, two. Yeah. Now you you can see how you can see how this pattern looks much no it doesn't look much better because if I rotate this uh, 45 degrees it's going to be similar to what Gen 2 wow no not 45 degrees 90 nitwit oh there you go I mean is that is that any better than what we had before uh, not much but it's there so that's another way of doing it. And, and the advantage of this, of course, is um, if you want, you can have several different materials. There. So, you know, you can have different materials, whereas the casing method that's all attached to the door, you don't get the several different materials. I, I never, I don't like to use these 3D moldings. They're just so tough to use. I actually wanted to do that top, was it? Anyway, I, I did it. I, I guess I did it. I don't get this global setting still. Ah. That's the global setting. That looks right. Not global set, global symbol mapping. That looks just as right. I, I don't get it. So there you go, guys. Another way of doing it. Then you can add bunches of different thicknesses and stuff. And I don't know why that's screwed up there. I thought it was better before. I thought I had it done better before. I get this gap right here. I just guess I have to go up to here to this doorway. Control X six U uh, height is uh, uh, ten foot to the uh, ten foot to the top, and it's uh, I guess sixty inches high. You, oh, floor to bottom, oh, 60. 60 and 60 is 10 foot, yeah, that, there it is. 
Eh, still not perfect. I thought it was better last time. It's pretty good on this side, isn't it? Not good on that side. Oh, that's because I have it. I have it. I don't have it quite there. That's better. Yeah, now it's good. It, it, I just had it located in the wrong spot. I mean, it was just tweaked a little bit. And now it's good. End of part four.